guys and welcome to another video. Today it's kind of a sad day because I'm going to sell one of my cars. I currently have four cars right now. I do have my BMW E91 318 diesel, I have my Nissan Skyline, I have my E39 528, that's not currently here, but I do have that still, it's just stored in a garage. Uh, and I have my Mazda Miata. Uh, and well, you can probably guess which car I am selling, or maybe not actually, but we can begin with my precious in the garage right there. Uh, my Skyline, I will not sell this. I usually have my like cool or expensive cars for one season and I sell them, but this car I want to have, yeah, for this season, two seasons, three, I don't know, but I want to have this for this season as well and upgrade it a lot, so you know that already. This car, it's been a good daily this winter and uh, I don't know if I need it this summer actually, but I really enjoy it, really like the look with the Porsche wheels and stuff like that. So really happy about that, uh, but I don't know how much I'm going to use that, but still, I'm going to keep it. Then we have this. Well, this car has also been like my winter beater, you can say. Uh, it's been a really fun car to have, a uh, really cool to experience having a car that only weighs 960 kilos. But uh, I mean, now it's coming to spring and uh, it's time to take the hard top off and experience this as a cabriolet. But I don't know if I need that car, to be honest, because I have my Skyline. So. It's actually the Mazda Miata that I'm letting go. I am selling my Mazda Miata. Uh, I simply a uh, deal popped up, uh, not a deal, but uh, someone was interested in uh, a Miata and I said that I have a Mazda Miata. So uh, yeah, she is coming today to pick it up and hopefully it will be sold and I think it's a okay deal. So I'm simply just going to, yeah, uh, let it go. It kind of sucks, but I mean, I already have like four cars right now, so I have plates on all of my cars, including my E39, and that's just silly. I just waste a lot of money on that, so that's no good. So I think it's a good idea to sell that so I don't have to use that much money on it. But I'm actually really happy about how it's turned out. I mean, I fixed the exhaust now, got some cool wheels on it, and uh, that's actually, I like the wheels, they're really cool. I removed a ton of stickers, and I fixed a lot on the interior. I have fixed like some of the light stuff. I've painted this and painted the grill. And uh, yeah, I got the plate on the front, fixed the idle uh, also. And yeah, I feel like I've done a couple of stuff with the car, so I'm quite happy with how it is right now. I kind of enjoy driving this um, back and forth to work. Uh, some of it, not every day, but a couple of times I've done it. <laughs> but the truth is, I don't use it that much. I've used it a couple of times on YouTube uh, to, make, uh, to make videos for you guys, but honestly, I have not been using this car as much as I thought I would, because driving this that as a daily in the winter compared to this car, which is much more comfortable. Yeah, I use that almost every day. I mean, this is my daily. You know what? I actually have like 20, 30 minutes before uh, the buyer arrives. So let's take this car for a quick spin and have like the last drive with the Mazda Miata. this car but I'm not gonna sugarcoat it I mean I am not sitting very comfortable in this car because I'm simply too tall if you see right now yeah. my head is in the ceiling right here 
as you can see, um, and yeah, no good. So I mean, it's not the most comfortable uh, seating position for me in this car, but I really like this. Like I said, see the pop-up headlights, see the steering wheel, have the cage uh, right behind me. I think that's really cool. And the sound, it's all right. I mean, it's not an SR20, but uh, it's a good sound. I mean. I don't think I will be able to drive this this much this summer because I have my Skyline and I would much rather drive that because that's like higher on my bucket list and now that I actually own the car I want to enjoy the car so uh, yeah now it's actually 10 minutes until the buyer of this car uh, arrives I'm excited to see how this all turns down A few moments later. It is kind of sad to see you go, but now I can use more money on this car and I have already done it because now I bought a lot of new parts for this car so yeah things are happening and I'm really excited about that so yeah I don't know what to say it kind of sucks but I think uh, always when you sell a car it is much better to simply just appreciate the time you got with the car instead of like being sad about that the car is gone so that's exactly what I'm going to do I'm going to appreciate the good times I had with the car so yeah let's take a look back and see what kind of memories and experiences uh, my Mazda Miata has given me I have some exciting news and that is we got some new keys <laughs> the car is gone and um, I, I don't know what to say really uh, the car is gone 
that's it. Maybe I will buy another one later. I don't know, it would be kind of fun to have a turbo Miata. And uh, yeah, happy about it. Really happy about it, actually. Really cool to like try that kind of car. Uh, and uh, perhaps we'll make a, like, a review of opening a Miata later on. But like first impressions, uh, kind of uh, disappointed with uh, the power to weight ratio. I was expecting the Miata to be a lot uh, quicker because it's so light. It was not, I mean, it's 140 horsepower, so it's not super quick, but I was expecting a little bit more. But um, all in all, it was a really cool car. And if you kind of drove it hard, it was a lot of fun to drive drive fast with. So uh, yeah, it would be kind of cool to try it also on like dry summer roads with the top down, but never got the chance. Kind of sucks, but that's life. I'm happy I got the experiences with it like I did. So uh, yeah, anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'm really excited for the future of this channel and my cars and everything. Uh, this is just the path to getting cool new projects. So uh, I'm excited. See you guys in the next video. Goodbye.